Hey guys, so this is a leather coral care guide. So these guys are really easy to care for. They like just, you know, decent water, decent lighting. So just about anybody can take care of them. They are peaceful corals. They won't, you know, just attack any corals. And they do like medium to high light. So that may be something to consider. The water flow they like is medium. So just a little bit of current because they have to shed. I'll talk about that in a minute. Now placement, you can place these guys almost anywhere in your tank. That's what's great about them. You can place them close to each other or just about anywhere. Um, they are photosynthetic. I do not feed my leathers at all. I know some people that do, um, but leathers are also toxic. So if you feed them, you'll also want to do water changes, but also you want to do water changes to get those toxins out. Um, these corals do shed about once a month. So that's why they need the medium to high water flow. Um, and that'll keep them clean and make sure they don't get clogged up. They can range from anywhere from like $10 to like $100 depending on size. So just keep that in mind for when you're looking for these guys. Um, this green one here I picked up for $29.99 at a local Petco. And it's grown enormously since then. So it's totally worth it. Now water quality, they'll handle a, a wide range. Anywhere from medium to perfect water quality. And uh, any warning signs or, you know, if they shrivel up kind of like... Uh, Kind of like your skin when you're in the pool or if uh, their tentacles are receded and they're not popping out that's a huge warning as well um, as you can see this one here all the tentacles are out the stock is nice and and open there's no shriveling um, so this is a really healthy leather coral right here um, this guy in my past video was really shriveled up so i did a water change and it helped him out enormously so check that video out if you uh if you need you know some some visual representation of what they look like when they're in distress but anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I appreciate all you guys' uh, views and subscri subscriptions, so uh, have a good one.